Credo Reference is a collection of around three and a half million full text articles from nearly a thousand uh, publications. And those articles or those entries are just from those print encyclopedias and they provided electronic access to those. So what you can do is very simply type in your search in the search box. You'll see below there's some variety of categories like health and medicine or history or psychology. And you can select those broad categories. But generally speaking, most people are going to start their search by typing their search in the search box. I'm going to search for a general topic like mythology. And I'll hit enter to conduct the search. What you'll see as a result list is a series of entries from print publications. So the first one you'll see is an entry under the title of mythology. It's from the Encyclopedia of German Literature. So that is the print source that it comes from. This collection, Credo Reference, has provided you online access to that particular entry. You can start to see a little bit of the entry. They'll show you the first few lines, and then they'll also provide you with a word count. So in this case, it's 2,612 words. That's a pretty lengthy entry. The next entry is from the uh, Thames and Hudson Dictionary of Italian Renaissance. It is only 828 words, which is still fairly long, but it's not um, quite as long, obviously, as the 2600. So you can gauge the length of the entry by the word count listed in the result list. Encyclopedia of Renaissance will focus on mythology specifically within the Renaissance period. So as you scroll through these, you can have a look in, at the results and decide which one fits you best. I'm going to look at this mythology in the Oxford Companion to Classical Civilization. It is nearly 2,000 words. I see some key concepts include Greek mythology, religion and mythology, and Roman mythology. So when I click on the entry, it will take me into that particular resource. I will be able to see all the text as it was originally printed in the print publication. Down at the bottom, I have a citation. This defaults to APA, but I can select MLA as well. And I would just highlight that and you could right click to copy that. So you can paste that into a, a works cited page if you'd like. It tells you more information about the editors and, and the original publication down below. So you can see that it was a print publication. If I wanted to save this item, I can click on save. I can also print this. And it has some other options as far as you know reading aloud. The citation will just take you down to the bottom of the page again. And that is a basic walkthrough of Credo Reference. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact your Lincoln Land Community College librarian. Thank you so much.